My father started this business ooh, more than 50 years ago, 53 in fact, back in May 1964. And he started it with the idea of being able to provide people with a service to help them move home and buy a family home. Um, obviously over the last 53 years things have changed a great deal in the industry and um, we've gone from pieces of paper with no pictures to videos and the like and 3D tours but the ethos here at Martin Gerard has very much stayed the same. It's always been about providing the best possible service to both buyers and sellers. Um, one of our big aims is to achieve the best for the people trying to sell a home and to help people who are looking to buy a home to find that piece of their life that they're looking for um, and so that they do fulfil their, their dreams, really. Um, a home is the centre of everything and um, is probably the largest asset that anybody's going to purchase. So I think it's vitally important that we try and help them find what they're looking for. Obviously that's not always possible, but if we can assist them and at least give them as much as they're looking for, then people do feel satisfied. Um, the greatest asset that, that we have as a business, I believe, is the staff that we have. Um, it's one of the reasons why several years ago I stood and was the uh, president of the National Association of Estate Agents Property Mark, and that was to raise standards in the industry. I've continued with that, and as well as professional standards, I also think it's vital that the staff are empowered to actually provide a service and the service that they'd want to receive themselves. So it's not just about buying or selling a home, but about helping people. Obviously, we deal in lettings and commercial, and we're talking about assets there as well as a family home. And so it's important that you have the professional know-how and the local knowledge that's required um, in order to provide that service. And we are constantly looking at ourselves and looking at ways that we can improve. Um, I think any agent that uh, relies on their success and lives by their success has to consider that the market is consistently changing and you have to re-examine what you're doing and make sure that you are moving with the times. You can't just stand still. So it's an ongoing process as far as we're concerned on taking on the technology, making it personal, um, helping it, helping staff to feel as if they are providing a personal service. Um, there are lots of different options and lots of different agents out there, so it's important that we are trying as best we can to provide what the consumer is looking for. Um, there will always be consumers that are looking to cut corners and looking for the cheapest possible service, but that's not what we offer here. What we offer is a very full service, we try and reach as many people as possible in order to provide that service and make sure that we are achieving the best for our buyers and our sellers. Um, I think it's vital that um, the staff are constantly trained and constantly provided with new information. Um, the knowledge of the local area is, I think, impeccable and we work very hard at providing that local knowledge because that's not something that you can get um, just searching the internet. Um, that personal service, knowing where the local parks are, knowing what's important to somebody who lives in the area is more important than just knowing the distance between a house and where the local train station is. So having that personal understanding of the area I think is vital. Um, I think that we are always looking to improve. Um, we look to our customers. I, I, I welcome um, complaints. I know that may sound stupid, but it's a way that we can look to improve the service that we offer. Um, it's one of the reasons why, if you look on our website, we have quite as many superb testimonials. It's not what we've written that people thought, it's actually in their own words speaking about the service that they've received from Martin Gerard, And I believe that's very powerful. 
Um, I think that if you are looking to instruct an agent, you shouldn't necessarily just look at the price they're quoting or the commission rate they're asking you to pay um, and judge an agency on that. I think you should judge it on the service that others have found that they provide and the fact that if they do have a wide-reaching um, service that allows advertising on all different mediums so that anybody who's looking to buy or sell a home comes to us, then you're in a much better position to provide the service that people are looking for.